What is up, YouTube? It's your boy, Diggum Graves, and I am back with another episode of MLB The Show's Road to the Show featuring Johnny Ellis. Now, in the last video, we dropped a game to the Bay Bears. We won the second one. Now we're going to jump ahead. I'll be honest with y'all. I've, I've been playing every single game, um, but I haven't been showing you guys every single game because I know you want to see Johnny in the show. You want to see the, the teams that you love. You don't want to see all this minor league play. So I've been playing a few games and then playing a few without recording. So Johnny's stats might come as a little bit of a surprise to you. You might be like, wait, he has how many home runs? I ain't seen him hit that many home runs. Well, that's because I've been playing without recording. So there we go. Johnny gets a fly out in the first. You know, easy. That's what he does. He doesn't make a lot of errors. Actually, he makes no errors in the field to this point, at least. Foreshadowing? Possibly. Bottom of the first, one out, man on. Johnny Graves to the plate. And he's going to chop that one foul, that low changeup. You know Johnny struggles with that changeup. So we're going to guess fastball high. We're going to try to take one deep here. And, oh, he leaves it up. That's gone. That is gone. Get wrecked. Get wrecked. Home run, Johnny Graves. Inside, it doesn't matter. You can't tie this man up. You throw it inside, throw it outside, it really doesn't matter. If you leave it up, he will hit it deep. Jumping ahead to the bottom of the third, two out, no one on. Johnny Graves one for one with a home run. Let's try to make it two. Can we make it two? We can guess fastball high again. Not going to get that fastball high. Ah, fastball at the ankles. Once upon a time, Johnny might have swung at that one. But, uh, you know, he's learning to be a little bit patient. He's not going to give it to us high. It's on the outside. It's deep. It's deep. Gone. Home run number two. Let's go. Johnny Graves with the bomb. Johnny is out here like Oprah. Johnny is channeling his inner Oprah right now. You get a souvenir. You get a souvenir. You get a souvenir. And these fans are loving what they're seeing. Loving it. These fans are going to be so sad. They they might they they might cry. They might be inconsolable when Johnny Graves gets called up. Because you know it's coming. You know it's coming. Anyway, jumping ahead to the bottom of the fifth. It is now a 4-1 game. We got a runner on. Two outs. Graves at the plate again. I don't even know why these guys are still pitching to him. I don't know how that's a strike. There's just so many questions going on right now. Sports writers are going to have a lot of material after this game, man. All right, once again, we're going to guess fastball high because that's what we do. That's what we want. That's all we really want to swing at. We kind of wish we could get that every single pitch, but it doesn't really work that way. Anyway, that's going to be a foul ball. A little bit early on that. That was outside, too. That ball did not go where I thought it was. I thought it was up. I thought it was a little bit higher and not so much outside the net. Big swing from Graves, and he just gets under it. And he pops it up to the second baseman. You see what I'm saying? There's a little inconsistency still with Johnny. All right, man, jumping ahead to the top of the seventh. There's still a 4-1 game. There's two outs, one on. And we're going to get another look at Johnny Graves in the field. If this pitcher ever pitches the ball. Here we go. In an easy fly ball, Graves barely has to move. Takes a few steps backward, looks it into his glove, and that's the inning. Jumping ahead to the bottom of the eighth. Chattanooga's trying to make it a game, man. They scored another run, but I'm, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling confident about this. The team seems to be playing well right now. There's one out, no one on. Going to guess high. Get a liner in the center field. That's just going to be a single, but you know what? That makes us three for four on the day. Following those two home runs, though, nothing really, nothing else really seems that impressive anymore. Moving ahead, still in the eighth, following a Romero strikeout, which is becoming a scene that I'm seeing way too often. McNeil is going to ground out to the third baseman. That's going to get him out of the inning, but it's all right. Because the generals are going to hold on. 
to a 4-2 dub. Taking a look at the line, Johnny went 3-4, for four, two runs scored, two home runs, three RBIs. Johnny is back. He is swinging the bat like he is supposed to be swinging it. Sometimes you just got to go out there and do what you do. Pick your team up when they're not playing well. Get it done by yourself, and that's what Johnny's doing. Let's jump ahead to the next game. Coming off the heels of a two-home run game and a 4-2 to two win, we are here back at it against the Chattanooga Lookouts. Johnny Graves up to the plate. It's going to be top of the first. We got one out, one on. And we're going to look to hit another home run. We just get under that one. It's going to be an easy fly ball to the center fielder. And just like that, all the momentum we built from yesterday seems to be gone. Jumping ahead to the bottom of the fourth. One out, no one on. Still a 0-0 game. Johnny Graves to the plate. Doing what he does best. Doing what he does better than anybody else in AA. Popping out into foul territory. 0 for 2 on the day, and that is depressing. Jumping ahead to the bottom of the 6, 2 out, no one on, still a 0-0 game, so the pitchers are definitely the stars of the show so far. So far, this game has been all about pitching. And he left it high, and you cannot do that against Johnny Graves. That one is gone. Damn, taking a look at the replay, he almost got that. Johnny almost just got robbed of a home run. But a miss is as good as a mile, and it's going to go down in the books as a home run. That dude might as well have not even attempted, because the end result's all that really matters. Jumping ahead to the bottom of the eighth, it is now a one nothing game thanks to Johnny Graves. Two on, or two out, no one on, and they are going to walk Johnny Graves. You can see the fear in their eyes, the softness in their heart. They do not want to challenge Johnny Graves. And to be absolutely honest with you, I don't really blame him, man. Now we got Romero up to the plate. This guy has been nothing but disappointing. Like, I look at him when he comes to the plate. They say he has a decent batting average. But every time I'm on base, this is what he does. He grounds out. Or he strikes out. I'm not sure I like him being behind me. But we are going to get out of here with a one nothing dub. Johnny Gray is providing the only offense of the day. That's just what he does. Anyway, man, if you guys enjoyed the video, do me a favor. Hit that thumbs up. I would appreciate it. I'm out for now, and I will see you all in the next episode. Peace.